Hey, Chris and Larry family. Hey, Berlin. Hi. What are you making today for us? Pork chop with cherry chutney. Cherry chutney? Good. Okay, so Berlin is putting together dinner tonight. How are you cooking your pork chops? in the crock pot, which is awesome. So I'm gonna let him take over and tell you what he's gonna do. All right, my friend, ready, set, go. Right. So what are you doing first? What do you need then? Do I put them in? Yeah, I would. No plastic bag. I know you know how to cook in the crock pot. <laughs> Don't roll your eyes at I, me. I know how to cook. Okay. In general. No, I know you do. Oh, they're still kind of frozen, which is perfect because they'll cook down. So there's like five three, or six. Three of them in there. Is there three big ones? Is that what it is? Yeah. Three big pork chops. And then this is the simplest recipe ever. I love pour and forget crock pot recipes. So what are you putting on the pork chops? Cherry chutney. Cherry chutney. And what is cherry chutney? Um, cherries that we did ourselves. So. Yeah, it's it's like a cherry salsa, basically, but we use it on meat. You don't eat it with chips. <laughs> um, it's got cherries. What else does it have in the recipe? Uh, allspice, cinnamon, stick. Yep. Uh, frozen red tart or sweet black cherries. Right, and we had red cherries. Um, large apple peels. What else is in there? There's onions in it. Red or other sweet onions, white vinegar, clove garlic. Okay, so it's a... Salt. So it's a cherry salsa. And brown sugar, yeah. Perfect. So you're gonna just do what with this? Dump it in? I just dump it on top. And then you're gonna turn on your crock pot for about five or six hours. Now this chutney, I will show you, we canned this ourselves. So this is, I mean, tasty, tasty. So <laughs> you made a funny face. It's got vinegar in it. It's it's definitely a salsa. Careful not to splash. Oh, you're splashing. Okay. That literally is all you have to do. And turn it on. Do you got this? Turn on, to on to high. So our crock pot, you just have to hit Manual high and then enter. And that is it. So we just gotta put the lid on it and go from there. So where is this recipe, Berlin? It's I lost you. In the um ball complete book home. Home preserving. preserving. Yep. So this is where that cherry recipe 400 is. Four hundred and delicious and creative recipes for today. Absolutely. And we use this book a lot for when we're doing canning. Um, but this is just an awesome recipe. It goes with chicken and it goes with um, pork chops or pork roast you can do. And we've done that. So we'll set this for, for six hours and it'll be nice and tasty. Yep, that book. We'll put a link to the book below as well as the recipe, um, the ingredients in the recipe, just so you can get a feel for what's in it. But are you looking forward to this? Yes. What are you gonna? Cook? What are you making with the pork chops tonight? What do you think? I don't know. Ew, maybe some frozen peas or something. Peas and rice. Or just meat. Just meat. I meat. love you. Well, check us out on the next video, and we will see you then. Bye for Bye. now. Bye.